You know what I found? A lot of people don't know how to fold sandpaper. You want to show quickly how to fold the sandpaper? Yes. You never put the grit against the grit. Dry sanding, all wet sanding. This little piece of dry sandpaper. I usually fold it four times, but the paper against the grit. And don't just fold it over once. That wouldn't be um, firm enough. It'd be too uh, flexible. You have to fold it at least twice. All right, that's about it. I'll do a quick polish. Well, I use a yeah. I use Viva towels for pol polishing. And this is 3M Finesse, and you should be able to get that at a marine store, stock room. That's what I use, but I'm sure there's other ones. And this is a 3M Perfected, that's the finest one I have. The Viva paper towels are just because they're so soft and they won't scratch like a yeah. regular Bounty or whatever paper towel will leave little fine scratches. I use Bounty for wet sanding, but you do. I think the Viva flavors. Still with the same polish right now. I don't do the finer polish till after I paint the cove and the boot top. Oh, okay. So you're just doing the first polish today. Yeah. We'll do another video later with the final polish, and then you do a little wax at the top when you're all done, right? Yeah. If I use wax, I make sure it's a pure wax, not a cleaner wax. Yeah. Sometimes the polish gets into the little grooves and stuff, so you have to really wet a rag, a very soft little brush maybe.
That will happen later with the wax, too. Well. The well, wax is getting a little I have something. Corners. I have something else I'll show in a second. After I polished, I found some specks of dust, so I'm just going back over it. Sometimes I use this at the very last. This just to polish, clean and polish. But I got it at the hardware stores, probably many different brands. I don't know if it makes that much difference, but I, when I'm all done with everything, I just square it over a little bit. After you wax? No. If I, I do, if I wax, I don't use that. Okay. I, but I use that more than wax lately. Okay. You would never use it before you put on, tried to put on another coat or a boot top or a coat though, because it will create contamination, fish no, you eyes. Have to have all your... It has to be completely done. You'll get fish eyes. You know, this. you can finish other things this way too. You know, if you had a nice piece of furniture or a... Like Tabletop? Jewelry top, a jewelry box, a top. You just, it's very important to get it as clean as you can and put on multiple coats of varnish. I guess you can use urethane too, which you find in your local hardware store. I guess that's it. Next time we'll be put on a white boot top, and I think it's gonna be white. And no, you're gonna do red. No, I think no. the red won't show up with the the mahogany. Mahogany as much. So. A boot top, a cove, and then the finish. Another polishing. polish, and then the spray polish. I have to do the red of it. To do the red of the same way. Awesome, it looks beautiful.